Hello beautiful people, my name is Fintan and for the next 10 days we are going to be down on the French Riviera and more precisely Monaco competing against the very best poker players in the world. Monaco is the most insane place that I have ever been in my life. Known for its ridiculous riches, fast cars, big boats, you don't have to pay tax here. And I've worked out that if I win the EPT main event for 1 million euro, I will be able to afford a 25 square meter apartment in the least desirable part at the very top of the worst hill. So that is the goal for this week. We are gonna play the EPT main event, we are gonna win it, and we are gonna move to Monaco full time. We absolutely rocketed up to 90,000 chips playing every pot, making full houses, making trips. Then I made a few second best hands and we finish 67,000. Average is 47. Got four more levels tonight, four more hours. Gonna try and get some food, come back and just try and bag for day two. What a goddamn adventure those first few levels were. I was all in in the first orbit with eight high. I then paid off Seb in a spot where I never should have. I was pretty much playing every hand, sitting around starting stack, and then it all started to kick off. Went really well for me. I get kings, so in raises in early position, I re-raise, comes out king, eight deuce with two spades. That's top set. I keep betting, they call. Turn is the six of spades, brings in the flush. They check, I bet a little bit less than half pot which was 4,000 chips they instantly make it 10k I'm scared I'm real 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 scared I call six on the river that's a full house they snap jam they've got jack 10 of spades and we cooler them for a monster pot gets me up over 60k and then only a matter of moments later blind versus blind I make trips and my opponent has top pair and just decides they don't want to fold for another 30k and we are go go carding up to 90,000 chips unbelievable start I did lose a little a small one just before the end of the break where I had ace 10 on 10 six deuce and my opponent had aces and we we put in quite a few chips so we're sitting at around 70k after the first few levels that we've played there is four more levels left tonight it is big blind 800 we have 70,000 chips i'm feeling pretty good we're playing lots of pots we're getting involved we're having fun on the table let's get a bag and make day two on one bullet After a very, very, very good start, things have gone downhill and downhill quickly. We had around 70,000 chips before this went down. I raise in early position. It gets called in middle position. I've got King Jack. The flop comes out King King 6 with a flush draw, clubs. I've got a club on my hand. This is looking great. It's against a player I've been beaking, chatting away, having a bit of fun with, and he's been trapping me a lot pre-flop. He flatted queens against me, ace king against me, and aces against me. Didn't win any big pots. I check, he checks. The turn is a four. Right, now there's two flush draws. I bet a little bit more that's in the pot, and he just min raises. We know this player is playing trappy, but he's not gonna check a king on the flop. You can't, you just, just, we've got too many chips. I call, reluctantly. The river is an off suit queen, which I think is a pretty good card because if he's gonna have a king, the most likely one is probably king queen. I check and he bets about what's in the pot, which is like a starting stack. It's almost 30,000 chips. I tank and I tank and I really wanna fold. If he's gonna have a king that checks, yes, it'll be a weak king, but how many weak kings flat from here? Not a whole lot. Talk myself into calling like I always do and they're never bluffing. He flat a king six suited we were on fumes then final hand before the break we've got 10,500 chips i shove with a7 lovely gentleman called philip that i've been playing with all day calls with nines and it looks like we are going to be going to the cage to re-enter we flop a flush draw and we turn him dead we have got about 23,000 chips there is two levels left in the day i would love to save myself 5,000 euro let's get it Busted in the second last level of the day. Ugh, it's a bit of an annoying time to bust because played all day, don't bag. Shoved over, cut off raise with 10 9 suited for 16 bigs. And it's Jack. We did not win. I'm gonna put this away for a sec. <sighs> I'm upset at myself for not making the big fold when I had to. Where's the bit of discipline when you need it? Ah! 
can say it's run bad. I don't think it is. I think you just need to make the big fold. People don't have the bluffs, I always say it. We'll be Max Late Regin, the main event tomorrow. Uh, I completely messed it up. I brought my tux, I brought my fancy shoes, but I forgot a shirt and I forgot a dicky bow. It's Monte Carlo. I wanted to feel like James Bond. I wanted to look like one of the rich people. I wanted to dress well for day two, but I don't have what I need, so I don't know what to do. Do I wear these shoes and then a t-shirt? Do I wear the half suit? I don't know, I don't know. And also, day two starts in 45 minutes. I've not regged yet, it's currently 11.15. It starts at 12. I need to, I, I need to hurry up, I need to hurry up. We are gonna be rebuying into day two for 20 big blinds. Not ideal, especially when I had like 100,000 chips yesterday, but it didn't go well. And sometimes that happens in poker. It's not all linear, up and up and up. You got a little few bumps in the road. So we are regging day two of the EPT main. I don't have much time to talk because I am seriously late. I don't think I can even wear my suit. I've messed up everything. We need to get down there. All right, we've got 20 big blinds on the dream. We gotta spin it up. All right, we have 34.5, a little bit more than we paid for on this bullet. First mission is get more than we paid for, for our 10,000 euros. So we need to get to 60K first. Then second mission, we get ourselves up here on the feature table. And finally, get into the cash. I guess there's gonna be like 180 paid or so. Alright, GG. We played three all ins, lost when I was behind, won when I was flipping, and lost when I was ahead. Race called Ace King, 100 off the money, big blind shoved with King Queen. Queen in the window, that is all she wrote. We are gonna get ourselves straight into the mystery bounty and not cry about still never cashing in EPT main. Fuck that. Not cry about still never cashing in EPT main. But I forgot a shirt and I forgot a dicky bow. The shirt was in my bag! No! No!